Hello, this is Jamie Green, editor of Investment Advisor Magazine and thinkadvisor.com, reporting from the IMCA Annual Conference in Boston. And I'm very pleased to uh, have with me today John Nersessian, who's the chairman of INCA for 2014 through 2016. And uh, part of his time, uh, he's actually got a job as well uh, at Nuveen Investments as a managing director working with uh, advisors. So, John, welcome. Uh, Thank nice you. to see you again. Thank you and, very much. Um, as chair of, of IMCA, What's your job, really? Uh, what do you focus on, and where's the where's the organization going? Sure. So clearly, one of our focuses is making sure that we continue to set leadership goals and objectives for the association. It's an association that's been around for more than 30 years. It's been very successful due to the hard work of others. Our responsibility as a current board is to make sure that we identify the key issues in our industry and that we continue to position the services and products of IMCA so that they're relevant for advisors in the future. Got a great legacy between the SEMA and the CPWA curriculum, but we've got some new initiatives that we're beginning this year that we think will help us be successful. Well, what are those initiatives? Okay, we use a <laughs> catchy phrase called CAPS. CAPS stands for Content, Awareness, Pricing, and Standards. And we think all four of those components are relevant to our membership, our constituency. Content ensures that, once again, we're providing the very best and most relevant services to a, a SEMA charter holder or a CPWA charter holder. We've made recent additions or changes to the SEMA curriculum to make sure that it's as relevant today as it was 30 years ago. We've added material on behavioral finance, the investment consulting process, alternative investments, and risk management, which we think are necessary skills for today's consultative advisor. On awareness, one of the things that our members has to have told us is that they want the SEMA designation to be relevant and recognized within the space. And so we're spending a lot of time and energy making sure that we get the word out so that our stakeholders have a more valuable uh, certification behind their name. On pricing, we hear it often, that the world is becoming a more price sensitive place and that we need to respond to those pricing challenges as well. So we've kept membership fees flat. We've done a number of things in terms of bringing conferences locally to different markets at very low, low cost price points, enabling our members to have access to content and to gain CE credits in a more affordable manner. And then finally with standards, there's this big issue out there in terms of what are the standards that we should be representing. I think we've done a great job with ANSI certification. The SEMA certification is the only one in our industry that has received ANSI certification here throughout the United States. And we think that means something to the designation and to our charter holders. I think you're right, and, and um, talk to me, many people know about SEMA, but what about the CPWA, that's a more recent designation? Good call. So SEMA's been around for, gosh, 35 years. CPWA has been developed over the past seven years, and we hope, we thought, that we were addressing a, a need in the marketplace. So in addition to the investment consulting expertise that an advisor gains through a SEMA experience, CPWA complements it, we think, quite well. It provides the practitioner with perspective on tax, on charitable giving, on estate planning, on working with closely held business owners and the complex needs of corporate executives, providing them with a comprehensive skill set that we think is necessary to serve today's wealthy family. So all those services that a wealth manager would, uh, you know. Yeah, if you want to think about it or com compartmentalize it, seem as about the investment consulting process, right? The investment advice that uh, clients expect to receive from an investment advisor. CPWA are all the complementary skills and services that are related to that overall wealth management relationship. Well, great. Thank you, John Nersessian, uh, Chair of IMCA and Managing Director at Nuveen Investments. And uh, thank you, viewers. This is Jamie Green signing off.